Howdy, everybody. This is Leo Claudio with Manus Stewart Nunn. It's indeed a pleasure to be here today and have, as our guest, one of the greatest infielders baseball has ever known. Now has joined the NBC broadcasting team with Kurt Gowdy. I'd like to welcome to our show the inimitable, incomparable Maury Wells. Welcome, Maury. Thank you, Leo. It's nice to be on with you. Actually, I'll be working with Jim Simpson. Tony Kubek uh -huh. will continue to work with Kurt. But it's the same team. Same team. Isn't that terrific? Same company. Yeah, that's right. Uh, but uh, Kurt will work the primary game. I'll work the backup game with Jim Simpson. Are you looking forward to doing that? I, I'm looking forward uh, with great anticipation and great enthusiasm. You, you should do a tremendous job because you've always applied yourself tremendously, whatever you've done. Maury, do you prefer this probably to the opportunity which may arise sooner or later to become a manager in Major League Baseball? Well, Leo, my, my desire to manage, uh, I've, I've been entertaining for the last uh, five or six years, uh, but I don't think there'll be a black manager soon, contrary to what the, the media has uh, had to say about it. So I was uh, really tickled when the opportunity came along to go with NBC, and, and I'm satisfied here, and, and I'm not even thinking about managing right now. Well, you're going to stay in the thick of baseball with this uh, broadcasting job, and it should be a tremendous thing for you, don't you think? I think it will. It opened a lot of doors for me. There's great opportunities to advance. Uh, the people are just wonderful. They, they've treated me great. Uh, I, I'm just, just tickled uh, to be with NBC. And you have so many friends, millions of friends all over the country, which uh, certainly, as you say, will help along. Thank you. I, I mentioned to uh, the crew that I'm working with here from New York uh, about uh, one of the finest things that ever happened to me in baseball is that no matter where I go, I'm not a stranger. And, and, and so far, everyone has uh, proven that, and, and it makes me very proud. Mario, you must have quite a, uh, a shed uh, or a warehouse full of bases. You, you did uh, a tremendous job over the years in stealing a number of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, I stole 104 in 1962, uh, 1965 I stole uh, 95, and then two in the World Series for a total of 97. Now, those were my, my biggest years of stealing bases. You know, Murray, I was amazed the other day to talk to Lou Bras, who was Brock of the St. Louis Cardinals, who was a base dealer by himself, as you know, and he was telling me that you were in the 30s when you stole 104. I believe I was 31 uh, when I stole 104, and then at the age of 33, I came back to steal 97. So... Uh, it, I talked to some of the, the players here in spring training now that are in the, around the age of 30 or something like that and, and try to impress upon them that an athlete is better after 30 than he is before. And the reason I say that is because at the age of 30, uh, 1, 3, 4, and 5, you're still young enough to do the things that you could do when you were in your 20s, but yet you have the maturity and you have the experience and the, and the knowledge to go with it, which, which makes you a much more complete athlete and a much better athlete. You're so right. Mari, uh, it's a art, isn't it, this base stealing? It has to be because there are very few who do it as efficiently as you did. It is an art, but, uh, to, but it's something that, that anybody can learn to do uh, because we can't all steal as, uh, as, 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 let's say, 104 or something like that, but, but, but it's just a matter, if you have just average speed, you can steal a tremendous amount of bases. It's just a matter of applying yourself and learning the different moves of the pitchers. Well, Mari, I see that our time is up, and I certainly want to thank you very much for this interview. This was an interview with Mari Wells, the former base-stealing great of Major League fame, and now a member of the NBC TV Game of the Week team. This brings us to the end of with Malice Stewart and for today. Until tomorrow at the same time, Leo Clark, and a good day. Brought to you by PosterFix, offering poster restoration and linen backing for 40 years. At PosterFix, we bring your vintage posters back to life. Please subscribe and hit the notification bell to get more classic sports interviews from Leo Cloutier with Malice Toward None.